Welcome to Jazz Time. JazzTime.com is an online store that buys, sells, trades authentic luxury watches. We make these videos so our customers can choose the best watch from themselves for themselves in the comfort of their own home. If you like these videos, please buy a watch at JazzTime.com and not at one of our competitors. Today, I'm going to be reviewing the Rolex Oyster Perpetual 31 reference 277200 green dial. I'm going to talk to you guys about the dial, the bezel, the case, the bracelet, the movement, try it on and give you my thoughts. So let's start. This is a ladies watch. It's an Oyster Perpetual made in stainless steel, all stainless steel. That's the entire watch, including the bezel, the bracelet, the case, everything. And it's 31 millimeters. That makes it a midsize from my thumb to my index finger. They make a 28, 31, and 36 for ladies. They also make a 41 for men's. So 31 would be for ladies. What kind of lady? A midsize lady. A midsize meaning an average sized woman. So if you have an average uh, wrist women, then you should this you, this is the size that you should consider. They make this watch in several colors. This is one of the outstanding colors. They make it in normal colors of black and blue, and they also make these funky colors, these hot colors, which you're looking at right here, which is the green. They also make it in hot pink, the regular pink as well, I think, and um, I think that's about it. So the 31 millimeter now. 31 millimeter from my thumb to my index finger is a midsize. It has this beautiful green dial. Uh, the green dial does trade, at least at the moment, at a premium. You probably could get the black and blue closer to retail, but the green one definitely sells at a premium. It's very difficult to get, as all watches are at the moment. So I'm going to show you the side profile, which is very thin. So that, ladies, it will fit like, you know, under your jacket cuff. Okay. And it has a domed bezel. Now, what does that mean? That means that this part, my finger is circling around. It's smooth and it's, it's made of stainless steel. What are the benefits of that? Well, one, it is very durable. If you have a white gold fluted, which is the one that has like the edges on it, like serrated knife edge all the way going around, it's not very durable. If you ding it against something, it breaks easily. It's made of gold. This one's made of steel. So you could wear this in any situation and it could still be very good when you're wearing a dress or um, you know more formal wear. It can do, that's the beauty of, of this Oyster Perpetual. It can go both ways, a sporting environment or a dress environment. Okay, now I want to talk about, I talked about the bezel, I talked about the dial, the case. Time to talk about the bracelet. Now the bracelet is a oyster steel, that's what they call it. It's actually just stainless steel basically. And as you can see here, I'm trying to hold it sideways for you. It's made of all stainless steel and it's brushed. That's the finishing. The, the finishing is brushed. Now what's good about brushed is that it doesn't scratch easily. And if it does, it's very easy to polish. The other alternative is on the day just that used brushed and the stainless steel, I'm uh, sorry, uh, brushed and high polish which makes it very difficult to, to, now this is high polish right here, which my, my finger is pointing at, and this is brushed. On other models, they make part of this brush and part of it's uh, polished, which doesn't make it very durable, okay? Now, I'll bring your attention to the buckle. The buckle closes like that, not, not rocket science. You simply close it like this and then push. But what else I can say about this is the Oyster Perpetual, since it's the entry line Rolex, Okay, it does not use a raised crown. What do I mean by that? Look at the profile. I mean the crown, the crown that, that signifies Rolex right here that I'm pointing at. Yeah, that one is not raised. Now you might ask yourself, well, why would I want it raised or flat? Well, you see, I'm trying to show it to you sideways. You see, there's no, it's not raised. I can rub my finger over it all day long and nothing. Why would you want it engraved? Well, one benefit is that it doesn't get broken, damaged. It doesn't get rubbed off with use. You don't have to be so careful about it. Let's say you take this and you wash your dishes like this and it hits the, the countertop. It's not going to rub away one of these Rolex fingers and become an Olex or Roll or R-O-L, right? You won't lose one of these hands because it's engraved. That's one of the benefits. It makes it, again, more durable. Very, very good. Okay, that's with the bracelet. Now let's talk about the movement. 
Now the movement is housed here in the back. Now Rolex, you can't see the back, so I will just tell you and you can use your imagination. It uses a movement 2232, that's the caliber number. It looks very beautiful, it's very intricate, it has a ton of parts, and it's very precise. It has a precision of plus minus two seconds a day, and for a automatic watch, which it is, that's actually very good. It used to be plus minus seven, now it's plus minus two. That's like a 200% a increase. And it has a power reserve of 55 hours, also very good. So yeah, basically it's a really very good movement, which you probably never see, but it doesn't really matter. You know it's working on the inside and it's really, really nice. Okay, as I promised, I talked to you guys about pretty much every part. Time for me to give you my thoughts and try it on. So my thoughts are this. If you are a woman and trying to get into an entry level Rolex, this would be it. Now, I would say that, now keep in mind, I'm a man. I have a man sized normal wrist. So this watch is going to look really small on me, which it does. But at least you can see like what it would look like on you, kind of. Okay, so very beautiful, as you would expect from Rolex. So my thoughts are this. If you want an entry-level Rolex, I think this would be a great idea. Why? Because number one, the durability. And you can still wear this with any dress, you know, if you have, um, you know, formal wear. Because it has a stainless steel bracelet and because if it's a Rolex, it still looks very, um, very, very good. You can wear it in a formal setting or you can wear it in a more sporting setting and you won't have to worry about it getting, like, beat up. Now, what do I mean by, like you know, why would you care about your watch getting beat up? Well, after some time, what happens is these links start to get, you know, the wear and tear, get scratches, they don't look nice. But on this one, since it has a brushed finish, it doesn't really do that, and it's always going to look very, very new. So that's the benefit. Okay, listen, if you like this video, or you like this watch, who cares if you like this video? If you want to buy this watch, you want to own this watch, you want this watch on your wrist tomorrow, click on the link in the description below and buy it from Jazz Time, not one of our competitors. You gotta buy it from Jazz Time. We make these videos so people like you can enjoy them and buy the watch at the lowest price anywhere online from the comfort of your own home. If you want to find out more about the watch you just saw in the video, you can just click below on show more to see the full description. Then you can check the link next to model as seen in video, click on it and you will get to the proper page where you can see all the details. If you're watching on the mobile phone, you have to click on the arrow down on the right hand side below the video to see the full description. If you like this video, please give us a thumbs up. If you would like to share this video with your friends, you can use the share button below and share it on any platform you like. If you have questions, constructive feedback, want to tell us about some mistakes or misspeaks, just write a comment below. If you want to see more videos like this, you should subscribe to our channel and visit our channel page where you can find all the videos. And if you're interested in a specific watch brand, you can check out our playlists. If you want to check the price for a watch or want to buy one, remember at jazztime.com you always get a steep discount, so you should check the prices with us. If you want to know the price for a specific watch, just go to Google, type in Jazztime, plus the brand, model and the details you're interested in and Google will find the right page for you. Thank you for watching.